was a devastating blow to the community there. Absolutely, Aaron. The Department of Fire and Emergency Services have described this as a terrible loss. 27 properties destroyed as a result of this bushfire in the Perth Hills. Now, of course, residents today were forced to flee their homes with two emergency warnings still current as they moved to two separate evacuation centres in the area. Now, what we have been told is that the conditions are simply too dangerous for them to, returning, to be returning back into the area or to be returning to their homes at this stage. It seems that the uh, very strong winds and also extreme temperatures in the area have uh, done uh, little to assist firefighters in their efforts to bring this blaze under control. Now, the Department of Fire and Emergency Services actually expects to stay in the area for the rest of the week, attempting to bring this fire under control. However, they are expecting more favourable weather conditions for tomorrow. The most important thing for residents to do at the moment is to keep up to date with the latest information on the DFES website. Aaron?